Is it on? As you know, my darlings, I've been recording videos for my granddaughter, Rebecca, like Rebecca in the Bible. Video diary to send us so she knows how grandmother's doing ever since I moved down to Texas. I found out that my granddaughter, Rebecca, was putting them on the internet, and I found out they were part of the Jamie Gray show. All I have to say is, yo, welcome to my fans. All of you guys are really big fans of everything that I do, and I'm still honored to be the honorary grandmother, Grandma Yolanda, the grandmother to all, for everybody that watches my videos. Well, here's the thing. This little nutcase named Adam, he also does videos for the Jamie Gray Show, and he calls a meeting recently. My attorney told me that I should be recording all of the meetings that we have. Now, my attorney is also my hairstylist and my best friend, but I promise you guys she knows a lot more than you would think an average hairstylist would know. So I secretly documented everything in case they tried to sneak something up that I wasn't prepared for. I emailed it all to my granddaughter Rebecca, like Rebecca in the Bible, and she prepared a video for you guys. Hey guys, it's me, Adam, self-voted president and fan favorite of the Jamie Gray Show. Um, I would offer some of my pour over, but I'm not really into sharing like that. Hi, I'm Isla, I'm glad to be here. Thank you for having me. Brody is present for the meeting. I call this meeting to talk about some very disturbing stuff uh, that's kind of happened with Jamie Grace and this guy, uh, Aaron Collins. Uh, yeah, at the Aaron Collins on Instagram, Looks like he made that Insta five minutes ago. They're engaged, Dolan. It's called love. Yeah, okay, who even are you? Grandma Yolanda, the actual show favorite. Real talk, Adam, we need to get this conversation rolling because I need to swap out my Easter Sunday natural dew for a springtime so when it flow will not wait for me all day. Here's the thing, y'all. I represent the one syndrome here at the Jamie Gray Show, which most of the show has been all about her being single, but now she's not single. So I'm trying to figure out, do I still have a job? Personally, I feel like in my own personal opinion that I have as a personal person, Jamie Grace has been single for as long as Wakanda has had access to vibranium. So I think it's a great time for the brand to finally expand on some new topics and not talk about this all of the time. Hashtag new life, hashtag new wife life, hashtag wife life, hashtag Christian couple, hashtag couples first Easter, ETC, ETC, ETC. Dumb. Dad? Oh yes, hi, I am here on behalf of the infomercial Least Expected, the spray that will help you find love. <laughs> Least Expected. Hold up, is that what she used and is it on sale? Uh, no, no, I was hoping that she did, but apparently everyone's love story is different. So after thousands of sad emails from a lot of sad people, I am now bankrupt or something. If something is a cold word for insane, I'm buying it. Speaking of buying, I'm still not buying this relationship. None of us even knew they were dating. Well, Dolan, they didn't date. They caught it. Okay, also didn't know she played basketball. It seems like she's keeping a lot of stuff from us. All of a sudden, they're having a wedding and they're inviting all of the world and the wedding is so fast, I didn't even have time to buy a tux. It literally just sounds like they're just keeping a major secret, so. Just like Wakanda kept Vibranium a secret. We get it, you woke. It's like I always tell my granddaughter Rebecca, like Rebecca in the Bible. Love is a beautiful thing and it cannot be planned out and written out all the time. Bishop J. Hopper says that love cannot be scripted. It's not an episode of The Andy Griffith Show or Facts of Life or even The Jamie Gray Show. I'm pretty sure this entire show is improv. I know, it's very obvious that you guys are all making this up as you go along. Here's the thing, if your heart is right, your intentions are pure, and your trust is in something greater than what's on this earth, I believe that God is going to bless you with a story that everybody else may not understand. But it will be beautiful in its right timing. Not always when you least expect it, but in the right time. And by the way, he's the perfect fit for her. He has the one, two most required things in life. Muscles and girls, muscles and girls. Mu well, one girl. He has one girl and a lot of muscles. Oh, that'd be smart. She's smart. Honestly, guys, the real reason why we're all here is to figure out if she's going to keep letting me, Adam, genius, keep coming on the show and giving dating advice. Because clearly, since I've been through so many relationships that haven't been long-term or permanent or successful, I have way more experience with dating and can give way better advice than Jamie can, seeing as she never had a boyfriend and she's just marrying her first boyfriend and they seem to be in love and will be together forever. I just feel like I am better equipped to give advice. So. From a purely brand and marketing perspective, I've been recommending that she cut you from the show for a really long time. Hashtag fired. Hashtag drama. Hashtag it's a casting call. Honestly, son, you kind of embarrass me. <laughs> 
Hmm. Do we all still have jobs? Do I need to call Taco Bell or something? I have some really good ideas for corporate. They need to add Spicy Ranch to the Quesarito permanently. It's a, it's a really good idea. I vote we subscribe and then we just wait because they've got a big old wedding coming in less than two weeks. Then they've got a vacation, AKA a moon for the honeys. And she's been waiting, 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 waiting on him. <laughs> that just made me so uncomfortable. Like more uncomfortable than... Like when Michael B. Jordan randomly called a battle. Brittany, it's kind of subtle, but is it possible that your hoodie is inspired by the culture and maybe a little bit of Black Panther? I mean, it is subtle. I didn't think anybody would pick up on it, but yes, Queen, you know it is. Party like a Collins. Did you guys get that? Why she picked that? Party like a princess, did you get it? Did you guys get that hashtag? Did you get why she picked that? Did you get it? I got it. Only thing I got, besides muscles and girls. Honestly, son, you need to get some help. <laughs> Honestly, son, you need more help than I can give you. <laughs> Honestly, son, you need more help than my company. <laughs> when I say Brody, you say Brody, Brody. When I say Brody, you say Brody, Brody. I heard it. Honestly, son, you need more help than my bank account. <laughs> and trust me, it needs help. When I say wedding, you say wedding, wedding. Honestly, son, you need more help than my mustache. <laughs> and my mustache or eyelashes. 